Captain Chris Meyer, Central Florida Sight Fishing Charters. I'm going to show you today how to tie this loop. It's a perfection loop. It pulls straight ahead. I use it uh, in the end of my fly leaders and you can also use it in the end of your fly line in case of an emergency you needed a quick knot in the end of your fly line. But uh, this is what I use in all the end of my fly leaders. I'm going to show you how to tie that. I'm going to use a piece of fly line because it's easy for you to see and I'm going to tie it as you were looking at it. So this is the way you'd be looking at it and we're going to take our right hand put it behind the left and form a loop so right behind left it forms a loop the next thing we want to do is come around in front of that loop with this tag end so the tag the short end is facing to the right we're going to come around in front of that loop tuck that in between your fingers and then take this tag end and lay it between those two loops and pinch that off so lay it between there, pinch it off. Again, I'm going to take it apart, lay it between there, pinch it off. Now we're going to reach from in here from behind. And we're going to grab this loop, that second loop we made. So reach in behind, grab that, and just pull that out, and that'll form your loop. And as you pull it down tight, there you have your perfection loop. And you can stick something in there uh, and pull down tight on that thing but that'll make a good knot for the end of all your fly leaders it's small quick and easy to tie so here's that knot again at a little faster speed put right behind left but come around all the way around in front take that tag in pinch it off reach through grab that first knot pull on it pull down and you can adjust that to any size that you want and you can trim that off nice and close after you pull it tight but there's a quick and easy perfection loop for using in the end of your leaders